What's up everybody, it's Sam again with another YouTube video. And this video, I just wanted to show everyone my entire WWE collection. As you see on the shelf here, I have all, just about all the action figures on the shelf here. I got, I even got a ring from each roster. I got SmackDown, NXT, Raw, and WrestleMania. And I even got people from different brands in the rings. See, this is so cool. Now, I know there's been a few shakeups, and you know, since then, but I originally know these people from the roster, so I just put them where I originally know them from. So, you see, I got all the SmackDown people here. See, I got Cody Rhodes with his mask. Sheamus back there. Brodus Clay, we know he was on SmackDown. Elias. Here's Orton right here. Right here, these are just the advocates. I got Hornswoggle there and Paul Heyman keep all the um legends here in the wrestlemania ring you see i got Shawn michaels bret hart andre the giant undertaker back there there's dude love in the back here's raw you, know, you see i got kurt angle the gm cm punk jericho you know raw's jericho john cena of course and then it's t now we all know ricochet kevin owens champ and all that um them have you know their own raw now but i originally know from nxt Gallagher, I got him back there. He's from 205 Live. But I don't have a 205 Live ring. But I originally know all these people. You see, I got Kevin Owens there. Otis. Um, Aiden English. Ricochet. Champa. Sami Zayn. There's EC3. I originally know these guys from NXT. So that's why I just put them here. I even got the belts. I got the World Heavyweight Championship. And the Universal Championship. This is the only Legends title I got. I got the Hardcore title. John Cena's United States title, the Intercontinental Championship, and the NXT, where is it? The NXT Tag Team Championship. So that's about it for the collection. Just look, get a good look at everything. That's Festus right there. Right here is the Retros. It's Michael Cole, Retro Punk, Retro Festus, also known as Luke Gallows. Now down here, this is my Flex Force Money in the Bank ring. It's the only Flex Force ring I had, and these are all the figures. I'll just tell you what they do. Uh, swing kick and Randy Orton, The Rock. He does some kind of a push and move. Um, punching Big Show. Front flipping Alberto Del Rio. Hip tossing Wade Barrett. Body slamming, back flipping Jack Swagger. Same with John Cena here. Elbow chopping Daniel Bryan. And front flipping Rey Mysterio. So that's just all the, the Flex Force figures I wanted to show you. And I also want to show you all this. This here is just another ring. It's not really a flex force. And I put the steel cage around it. The cage didn't come with it. I just got it for a birth, my 15th birthday. It just has a door and the sides open up. So you can like slam your, your opponents through it. And it's got another part right here. So that's about it. Now these here are just more of some of my mini figures. Let's get a good look at everybody. I got... Kane, John Cena, CM Punk, Rey Mysterio, Sheamus, and Brock Lesnar. This is actually a UFC figure, but it still goes along with WWE. Now more of my minis. This here is my Rumbler set. You just pedal the paddles, and they just, you know, rumble around. These three right here, John Cena, Sheamus, and Rey Mysterio, they come with the ring. The others I just bought separate. I didn't really have any Rumblers. And these here are my Slam City figures. I only have three. Just Big Show, John Cena, and Undertaker. And over here, these are my weapons here. See, I got a set of steel steps there. But in here, I just have my weapons. Like, here's another set of steps. And here, I just have extra gear where I used to play with kids. You see, I got chairs. The ECW title. I don't have ECW collection. And... The toolboxes, Undertaker's grave, a mini table. I even have a referee. Uh, an extra hat that, um, that goes on the superstars. This here is just a monitor. WWE Tough Enough belt. It came with Kelly Kelly up there. See, it even has her, her name on it, Kelly Kelly. That's, and here's just weapons and stuff. And the referee. I got more weapons than this one. I know these are wet white boxes. I used them to be announce tables. This one I used to be a casket for Undertaker. See, I got ladders in here. Here's a surfboard that breaks in half. 
and I got a table here that does the same thing and these are from water bottles but I use them to be trash cans and I, before I had an actual announce table I used to use these you know these old pocketbooks here to be tables and down there that blue thing is a stretcher it came with one of my Brock Lesnar figures so that's just um the weapons I wanted to show you and here is my micro set here's my micro ring I know I got some of the same guys here it's mostly Rey Mysterio four of them come with the ring so that's how I got the same ones and here's my micro elimination chamber ring and these aren't really micros I'm not sure what they were I got them from the Dollar Tree but these are just these are the only superstars I found you see I got the Rock, the Tribal Chief, Roman Reigns, Finn Balor, John Cena and AJ Styles and here this is my hell in a cell ring all it does you can just throw your opponents through it and the doors on top break open got a little force in it so that's about it but this isn't just it for my collection i got a few more gears right here i got this for christmas is miss elizabeth she's dead now so i'm just gonna keep her in the box because usually like stuff if it's somebody who, who died it's worth more to keep it in the box and i got more superstars in here it's just the same people i got on the shelf i used to keep wrestlers at my parents and grandparents house that's why i have so many now you see here's here's randy orton i'll just show you quickly everybody D generation x triple h cm punk this is a ufc figure but i don't have a ufc collection so i just pull my wrestlers this is bad boy shogun rua kalisto andre the giant john cena um sid justice i use him as a referee kevin owens chris jericho another john cena i got like 10 john cena just being honest got him here and here aj styles samoa joe bray wyatt Dolph Ziggler, Kane, Antonio Suzaro, Rey Mysterio, Roman Reigns. So you look at the tribal chief there. Brock Lesnar. And lastly, these are some big superstars. Huge compared to this one. I got just Finn Balor and The Rock. So that's about everything, my whole entire collection of WWE gear. And I'm going to go to my parents' house later to show you everything else. Because this isn't everything. This is just all the figures. I'll be back. I also forgot to show y'all that I make my own banners for the rings. You see, I taped WrestleMania right here in the middle. I cut it out of a magazine and taped it here. Same on the side right there. And... This right here, WrestleMania Heritage Series. This came with a figure, but just wanted to show I make my own banners. This says Hell in, uh, This says the sale it's supposed to be Hell in a Cell pay per view, but I taped NST Takeover banners on the side, which looks real cool. Just wanted to show you all that. What's up? I'm back, and I just wanted to finish showing everyone the gear I got. I'm at my parents' house now. These are the classic toy belts. I got as a kid, which I could wear them. They're for children, though. I can't wear them no more. But this is the old World Heavyweight Championship belt. I got it for my 13th birthday, and I even put my name labeled on the plate there. It looks like real gold, but it's plastic. But it's a cool belt. And then I got the Cruiserweight Championship that I got for my 19th birthday, I think is what it was. And... The belt that I would want to win if I were a superstar, the Hardcore Championship. This is really cool. This is the belt I'd want to be after, to be honest. And I even got this cool WWE book bag. It's got the superstars on it. You see, I got John, see John Cena, Triple H, CM Punk, Kofi Kingston. I used to be a fan of all these guys. Sort of still am not all that crazy about Batista or Triple H anymore, but I just like this book bag. And I also got this. It's a John Cena stuffed animal. It's pretty cool. 
My dad got it for me when I was a kid. Still have it now. I used to keep my wrestlers in this. I'm just going to let you know it's not a good idea. Because if you looked at some of my wrestlers, you know some of them were like missing hands and stuff. Some of them broke from being cramped up in here. You want to keep them in a container, not a book bag. Now I'm going to show you some more stuff I have. I got this cool John Cena poster right here. The Never Give Up Cena Asian Capital Punishment 2011. And I got this really cool Undertaker poster from WrestleMania 30. I know it's missing a corner. I cut the WrestleMania out off the corner to be a banner on one of my rings. I covered it up with NXT TakeOver. This here is the Divas Swimsuit competition from SummerSlam 2013, which Summer Ray here won it. I personally think Naomi should have won it. This is the Divas Swimsuit poster I have. I'm going to show you more. This is my Yeselmania poster from WrestleMania 30 in 2014. It's one. Dan Bryan won both the titles after defeating Randy Orton and Batista. And last but not least, this big old poster I got of the Tribal Chief Roman Reigns. It's a poster I got for my 17th birthday. I know I may no longer be a fan of Roman Reigns. I mean, I still am, just not a fan of the way he's been winning his matches recently. But this is a cool poster, and I just like it. It's really cool. At the end of the video, there's just one more thing I want to show everybody. Check this out. This is me when I was 13. John Cena. I met John Cena. That is so cool. I got his autograph too, but sadly somebody stole the magazine he signed. Not too happy about that, but at least I still got the picture with him. And what's so cool is he was champion at the time. That's the night he defeated Ryback in a tables match, and he even let me hold his belt. That is so cool. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video, and I hope and I hope you know y'all y'all got a kick out of seeing all my gear and stuff. So I gotta go now because SmackDown's about to come on. Goodbye. What? I can't believe I forgot to show y'all these. I got me and Gene Okerlund. And I got Andre the Giant's luchador character from Mexico, the Giant Machine. He's never been unboxed. Mean Gene Okerlund is, but he looks better displayed in the box, so I just keep him in there. But this one has never been unboxed before. So that's it for the video. Thanks for watching.